New this morning, UC Davis Medical Center is playing part in a groundbreaking discovery for treating a certain type of muscular dystrophy. Duchenne muscular dystrophy, or DMD, is a rare disorder causing muscle loss and physical impairments in young people. A clinical trial is offering some hope for patients. Take a listen. Eric Barthel has spent more than 30 years getting treatment at the Muscular Dystrophy Association Care Center at UC Davis. He has Duchenne Muscular Dystrophy, or DMD. The uh, progression is always changing, so there's always new challenges that I have to adapt to. It's a neuromuscular condition that's typically found in young boys. They get progressively weaker in the arms, legs, even heart tissue, which can lead to heart failure. But a new clinical trial is helping improve the signs and symptoms. UC Davis served as the lead center for the HOPE trials. It used stem cell therapy to fight the impact of this disorder, and the results are good. Uh, these boys and young men actually had uh, IV infusions of the stem cells every uh, three months, uh, and uh, they actually um, had really tremendous benefits uh, from this uh, therapy uh, in terms of improvement in heart function and, and also a delay in the uh, progressive loss of uh, arm strength. Dr. McDonald calls this a, quote, genuine breakthrough. These patients are able to uh, feed themselves. Uh, they're able to scratch their nose, uh, operate a power wheelchair. And with the uh, improvement in arm function, you know, they're even able to uh, give their moms a hug. Barthel says the findings are super exciting. It's taken a lot of years and money being raised finally get to this point that we're at. And it could mean a lot for a lot of people. Phase three, hope three, is set to start within weeks. Dr. McDonald hopes this could lead to FDA approval of the trial stem cell therapy findings.